As a young boy, Jean-Jacques Dessalines had always dreamed of freedom. But growing up on a plantation in Saint-Domingue, he knew that the odds were stacked against him. He watched as his fellow slaves were whipped and beaten by their cruel masters, and he knew that something had to change. One day, while working in the fields, Dessalines overheard a group of slaves talking about a man named Toussaint Louverture, who was leading a rebellion against the French colonizers. At first, Dessalines was skeptical. He had heard stories of other uprisings that had been brutally crushed, but as he listened to the slaves talking, he began to feel a spark of hope. The next day, Dessalines made his way to a secret meeting place where the rebels were gathering. There, he met Louverture for the first time and was struck by the man's quiet determination and intelligence. Louverture recognized something in Dessalines, a fire and passion that could be harnessed for the cause of freedom. Over the coming weeks and months, Dessalines trained as a soldier and fought alongside Louverture and the other rebels. He quickly proved himself to be a skilled and fearless fighter, always at the front lines of the battles. But as the revolution gained momentum, Dessalines began to realize that the fight for freedom would not be easy. The French were powerful and ruthless, and the slaves were often outnumbered and outgunned. But Dessalines refused to give up. He had seen too much suffering and too much injustice to turn back now. And so he fought on, driven by his fierce determination to create a better future for himself, his fellow slaves, and his beloved homeland of Saint-Domingue.